Okay, the microphone is on. <laughs> uh, I don't know why. It's like every video, I don't know how the YouTubers do it. It's like their on-camera personality is top-notch and then their in real life personality, well, I don't know about that, but on camera they're fine and well <laughs> I just don't have it down <laughs> right Ryan you'll get it in time <laughs> okay um well I am filming today because today is the day that my bundle of joy was born and I did not birth her obviously she is my dog I love her oh she's so cute I love her she's my best friend I don't know I thought about doing a furry friend tag and I figured do people even do those anymore I really don't know um yeah my dog turns one today and I'm so excited and my sister's boyfriend turtle turns 20 today <laughs> anyway okay so we're not gonna go shopping today well we may go shopping I'm not really sure um but we're not gonna go shopping for Fawn's gifts because I got them a few days ago and I took footage of that and I will insert the footage if um no. I will insert the footage if my uh Editing skills are up to par. I'm not gonna promise it because I'm not sure if they are up to par. So my Fawny was born um, August 15th. 10:40 p.m. and the only reason I have it so close I'm not like a crate like I'm not crazy about like all that kind of stuff the only reason I have it so close is because she's my first like real um, pet that I've gotten to have like where like I've had dogs before like and cats before and hamsters and everything but I know when your parent buys you a pet and they take care of it because you're just not old enough to take care of it that was always the case for me and they're always really all of our animals are really always attached to my mom I don't know what it is it's just she's really nice to them and I'm really nice to them too um it's just they all they always get attached to my mom I think like a lot of a lot of the dogs we end up getting like adults more than children like that's just in their breed they're more drawn to like adults than children and th there are dogs like that like I've used to watch Animal Planet I'm sorry okay <laughs> anyway but um the only reason I have it so close is because I um, found my dog on Facebook and no she wasn't like a purebred or anything like that I didn't pay like a lot of money for her um, she was just from a litter like a local litter around here and um, yeah she was she's just from a local litter around here and uh, I pretty sure she's like a Great Dane hound mix um, she's beautiful. I, I love her. She's the cutest thing in the world. She's so playful and she's the best. I just, I love her. She's so great. Uh, and she, she's kind of like fawn and, um, white colored and then she's got little spots on her. And, um, yeah, so that's why I named her fawn. I thought she kind of looked like a little deer, like had little deer char characteristics. And deer are my favorite animal. I just really think they're cute and pretty and everything and just... I like them so yeah and my that's why I named her Fawn so I got her a top paw rope toy because she's taken all of her toys outside she has not failed to take any of them outside she takes them all outside she's very destructive because she's a big dog she just likes to play Great Danes have a nature to be very playful 
Um, and that's okay. I don't really care. I mean, like, do what you want. But I really, I'm gonna try to keep these. I'm gonna try to keep these toys inside because I really want them to stay inside. I want her to have inside toys because she likes to have inside toys. She's got enough outside toys. And this one was really nice. Brushes over teeth and massages gums. I don't really know if it does that, but I thought it was nice. Nice advertising. And it says it helps remove plaque and tartar buildup. So I thought, you know, pretty cool. Um. Yeah, I got her at PetSmart. I got all these at PetSmart. Um, you know, so. And I donated a dollar. Like, they were, it all came out to be $28. And I know that sounds like a lot. Uh, but I love my phony. And, like, I, I don't normally, I, w I wouldn't normally go all out. Like, it's just, I've never gotten, I've never had a chance to get, like, to nail down my dogs, my pets birthday and I've never gotten a chance to like get them a gift or anything so I just really wanted to get her something so I got her a rope and a like a little Kong bone and I'm really excited about it and then I got her they were having a deal on treats like a three for five thing so I got that yeah so got her this I wish it was black but you know I kind of all of her toys can't be black I I really like the color black I yeah I just do so, I just know she's going to really like this because she really likes ropes. I mean, most dogs do. And the next thing I got uh, was a Kong goodie bone. And it's like a medium because these things were very pricey because they're Kong. And they're made for power chewers. Um, yeah, and you can, you know, it's a Kong thing so you can insert a treat um, into each end because it's like the bone one. And, yeah, I don't know. And I'll probably put peanut butter in it because I don't have any, like, I mean, I have treats, but I don't know if they're going to fit. Like, they may they may fit. Not. Oh, it's so pretty. I got the black one because black. You know. Okay. <laughs> anyway. Okay. I'm really excited. And then I got three little Vera treat things. I got two chicken jerky filet things. And then I got one pork and salmon sausage thing. Yep. And they were three for five dollars. So I was just like pretty good. And then uh, I used a PetSmart card and I got um, some points and a little bit of money off. Like, you know, so that was good. And then the little thing uh, took my card and asked if I wanted to donate to the dog fun thing and I could not so like I put an extra dollar on there so it was like basically thirty dollars at the end and I mean you know whatevs it's cool I'm, I'm excited that's what matters and I'm probably gonna tape Fawny playing with uh, her toys and stuff I'm really excited I don't tell you about the dog and everything Fawny's best friend uh, is Vegas our other dog and he is like so cute he he will jump up on your leg and he reaches about like your mid calf so he'll like um he'll like hug onto your leg and he'll like make sure that he's locked on so he'll stay and then you can rub him and he's so cute he's like he's like a medium sized dog on like little legs and he's he's just like a miniature rottweiler that's what we call him because he's got like rottweiler teeth and he has rottweiler colors and he looks people like to call him like a little beagle he looks like a beagle he also looks like a rottweiler like he's so cute though he's like adorable and then um i don't know like oh and my fawny she has like two little heart spots on her like i don't know they're so cute so it's like she has three hearts and it's adorable and they both have brown eyes because, you know, it's just typical. And then we have a cat named Charcoal. He's beautiful. They like to mess with him. Um, but, you know, he's like six and a half years old. He's pretty, he's pretty okay with it. Like, he's very sassy. He's the most beautiful cat that we've ever had. And I name all the animals. I named Vegas. We got Vegas first. No, no. We got Charcoal first. I named Charcoal, and I named Vegas, and I named Fawny. 
well her name is Fawn but I have a lot of nicknames for all of them uh but yeah dog ears Fawn has the biggest dog ears like she they're like elephant ears I love them I really like to rub them I don't know why it just calms me down like I really one day I really want to get like an emotional support dog like no joke like I don't want to keep saying like um but I really do I think it would really help me um but that's like another story yeah so um but I they really calm me down I just I love them and she's like my best friend so but uh yeah I thought of fun and I, I I you know ran with it I started calling her that everybody caught on to it and I just love the name at first people didn't want to call Vegas Vegas um but I kept calling him that and everybody started calling him that and I was just like that's great because like he's Vegas that's just what he is so yeah I don't know probably gonna just put some footage in of her playing with her new toys maybe because I don't really have a lot like I probably should have wrote out a bunch of stuff about her but this was kind of like an impromptu video like I knew I was gonna film it because I really wanted to film for her birthday um but I know she also really wants to play because it's, I mean it's her birthday and she doesn't it's not like she knows it's her birthday but like she really wants a new toy oh another thing about her hold on I, I really want to say this she you know how like in the movies there are like dogs that have like really loose lips uh like really loose skin around their lips and they'll snore and then their lips will flap never seen a real dog do that until i got fawn because her her like lip skin or whatever like around her snout is like really loose and it flaps like it'll it'll make that noise while she's snoring and it's the cutest thing i haven't gotten it on tape yet but i really want to I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with my dog. Like I, I love her. She's so cute. I'm a, like I'm so attached to her. I don't know. I have like a Facebook album of her. I don't have an Instagram account of her, but you know, whatever. Um, she's so cute. And then, never met a dog do the downward dog yoga pose as much as my dog does. And that is true. Everybody knows it. Everybody knows it. She does it so much when she gets out of bed in the morning, she'll do it. She does it for anything. Anything at all. I don't know what it is. She loves to do it. It's like her routine. It's like her, I don't know. She loves it. She's a yoga instructor. Okay, that is it other than um, footage. I will probably insert that. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> she's so cute. I love her. Hello, buddy. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. You're so Happy cute. Happy birthday to you. Ryan's taking a nap Happy before he goes to work. To you. And Fawn is terrorizing him. Happy birthday. Put it on your bed. I made her a huge bed. I mean, like, it's on top of a bed, but it's also got covers on it because she likes big beds. Anything to say? Probably not. Like the rope? 
我就，哎呦我我。Like and subscribe if you want to. And I will be back with more subpar videos in the future. Also turns one. No, <laughs> no he doesn't. I'm so sorry. <laughs> he, also, he does not turn one. <laughs> My sister is not a cougar. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have such a, like, I swear sometimes my blooper section is gonna be bigger than the video section. Did you say cougar? Yes. You, you probably meant pedophile. No. A cougar is a woman who prowls on younger men. <laughs> yeah, but if he's a what? A pedophile is a man. No, women can be pedophiles. But a cougar is a woman. So I just put that together. <sighs> We're not gonna have this argument. Oh. This is my fawn special. The cutest bit. little thing. Um, but she was kind of stupid. She ran into walls. I don't know. She was so cute though. Um, and she had the softest fur. That's what I really liked about her. Cause rubbing like dog fur or any kind of like soft fur or like dog fur, give her a few like donuts too. Like not real donuts, like because I don't, I wouldn't really want to waste like a, a donut on a dog. But like, we have these disgusting donuts. <laughs> oh, these disgusting donuts. Uh, and I knew they were not gonna be good. I just knew it. My mom got them. They're they are powdered blueberry donuts. That doesn't even sound good. Like powdered. Powdered sugar donuts are good. Like, powdered donuts are good. Blueberry donuts are good. Leave it at that. Like, you don't need to... You don't need to do that. It's so gross. Don't waste your money. Like, I don't know why she did. But, they're so nasty. Like, I just... Fawn likes them. I mean, Fawn likes any 